Welcome back to City Scene TV. As promised, we are now going to meet with Catherine Cooksey and Jody Pena from Studio Channel Islands. So, so welcome to the show. Thank you. Thank so, you. for anyone who's unfamiliar with Studio Channel Islands, could you give us a quick commercial? So, Studio Channel Islands is actually the largest gallery in Ventura County. We um, took over an old elementary school, so we have the gallery that's on our campus and then 40 artist studios as well. Um, at the center, we're a nonprofit art organization, so we have um, programs for children, adult education, classes, workshops, um, different events throughout the year, so it's really um, a creative cultural hub located in Old Town Camarillo. Okay, great. So what are your roles in <laughs> Studio Channel Islands? We have lots of roles, <laughs> but Catherine is actually our gallery director. Okay. She's the visual part, the front part, makes everything look pretty. <laughs> she brings in the artist, uh, sets up the gallery. I am the director of business operations. I'm behind the scenes, okay. and I do all the finance and business and all the renting facility operations, that kind of thing. Okay. Great. How many artists are at your um, facilities? We have about 37 artists in residence and about 150 artist members. The artists and residents don't live there, but they rent studio space from us. And then we have other artist members that participate in our organization. So you have one artist in residence who is quite famous. Yes, yes. Um, he's been in movies or films for over 30 years. Home Alone, Diner, Breaking Away, Daniel Stern. Yes, mm -hmm. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> that's um, right. What are some of his art of choice? What does he like? He is a bronze artist, oh. so um, sculpture. He's been with us for about four years um, and has two studios with us because his sculptures are very large. Um, they're mainly humans, but he also um, does creatures and dogs, and they're all very humorous. Uh, we're in the process of installing one of his sculptures at the front of our um, gallery, but we also have several of his uh, sculptures on our campus. So if you come out to the campus, you can see a lot of his pieces around. They're very active pieces, mm -hmm. always people in action. That's pretty neat. Okay. So earlier this year, a local comedian by the name of Jason Love started doing comedy shows. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, at uh, that location. So can you tell us a little bit more about how that's going? It's great. We have, it's <coughs> called Comedy and Cocktails and Jason Love is our host and he brings other comedians from LA area, most, actually they're mostly from LA and Hollywood. Okay. They've been on The Tonight Show, they've been on HBO, they're just all different um, levels of comedians and we have had great success with our shows. It's always a sold out show, uh, it's a lot of fun, he usually has a main comedy act mm -hmm. uh, along with a couple other understudies or you know just not mm -hmm. as quite the level mm -hmm. that the main one is um, we usually have about a hundred to hundred and fifty people in the gallery oh wow um, tickets are only fifteen dollars and it's a lot of fun it's it's a great evening out so yeah. if someone wanted to go to the you know cause you said it sells out it so does how it's on our soon website should they buy the tickets? They, usually two weeks in advance is best wow yeah usually uh, if, if we have any at the door they sell out very quickly and can't get back in so it's a lot of fun. It's fifteen dollars. It's on our website, studiochannelislands.org. Do you know when the next one is? It is December sixteenth. Oh, okay. Well, Usually okay. they are the fourth Friday of the month, but because of the holidays, we've had to adjust our schedule. So the next one is December sixteenth. Do you have anything else going on around the holidays? We have or? a huge event that's coming up this Saturday, um, December third. It's called the Holiday Market. And um, we bring in some of our outside artist members along with our artists and residents and they get together and they make their studios, um, they dress it up for the holidays but then they also have things that you can buy for the holidays so if you want a unique piece of art or that's handmade, this is a great event to go to. It's free to the public and then we also have workshops that's going on throughout that day too, um, art projects for kids decorating ornaments, so it's a it's a really great event to go to. Sounds like a great opportunity to come get a unique gift. It is, a lot of gift giving. Cheryl Heddleston, who's one of our artists, she makes jewelry. Oh, so. oh very pretty. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. So, um, I understand you brought some photos. Yes, we did. So, mm -hmm. maybe you want to talk us through some of the photos? Sure. So, this is our comedy and cocktails event that's coming up in December. Starts at 7. 
This is a wonderful project that is ongoing right now. It's a installation that's going up on our fence that um, is seen by our gallery and our artists have band together to get donate chair, donated chairs. They've painted them all red and each of them have words on them so you can come throughout the month of December and February or January and then play with our chairs and make sentences out of them and it's a really fun interactive project for people that come visit the gallery. This is our last show that we just had. Um, it was an interactive art piece as well that come into the gallery and write on the wall or on the floor. It was called our graffiti wall from one of our artists who um, just had a show called Street Urban in November. It was fantastic. That's our comedy and cocktails, one of the events that we had. This was a first time event that we had. It was a pop-up art show called In the Dark. Um, it was a one night show that went up that day. Uh, the artists came from all over the place, LA, Ventura, and uh, people came dressed up, and it was a lot of fun. Huge Something success. new. Mm -hmm. It was awesome. This was just another snapshot, snapshot of that event, uh, seeing people dressed up. This is Daniel Stern. He was gracious enough to offer uh, an event that was part of our fundraising to our big donors. He came and entertained us with songs and comedy that night. We have a program that brings in children from different schools and give them tours of the gallery and studios. And they get an art project with that as well. This is one of our um, art classes, our kids that have done different projects. This is just a snapshot of the gallery, one of our openings. This is our part of our campus, so the 40 artist studios that we have. This is a snapshot of the campus that they work at. This is our gift store. It's um, part of the gallery, so if you come in our gallery and are looking for gifts, this is a great place to stop first, and then we can give you uh, more direction on other gifts if you're looking for something more specific. We also have art camp every year, every summer and spring. Um, and so we bring in artists to come and teach our children different, uh, different art projects every single day. And they graduate at the end of art camp and each get a certificate. So you have classes available for kids, the general public. Mm -hmm. Can you just tell us a little bit more about those? Well, we have, we, as Catherine was talking about, our kids' summer camp. Mm -hmm. it's, we, there's two two-week art programs, and they get a different art project, art education, each, each day. They get actually three different ones each day. Mm -hmm. So we have multiple art teachers that come in different mediums, and it's really exciting for them because they get to put, get their hands involved in all different kinds of art mediums. We also have adult classes and workshops. A lot of our um, artists and residents provide private workshops, and that is all available on our website. How old for children? How old do you have to be for your camp? Six. Six to sixteen. Okay. Mm -hmm. And classes too? That depends on the artist teaching okay. the class. So great. Um, you talked a lot about Daniel Stern. But what about all the other artists there? Can you talk about some of the other resident artists? Well, we have uh, our resident artist, Mary McGill, who is actually showing in our gallery for December. Okay. She's a ceramic artist. Some community names you might know, Maggie Kildee, she's also mm -hmm. a ceramic artist. Uh, Pat Dodds, who does paint. And some of our artist members, Brent Hansen does paint, and Kim Clark is another ceramicist. Mm -hmm. Okay, so not to ignore our guests here, so what about your guys' art? I'm not an artist at all. <laughs> um, so, I am an artist. I'm actually an artist in residence with um, Studio Channel Islands as well. I just, I was working for the gallery two years ago, left, went to New York, got my Master's of Fine Art and came back recently. Um, but my artwork that I do is conceptual art, so it's based on 
um, my history, I have a visual eye disease and I also worked in the beauty industry, so it's kind of bringing those two worlds together in uh, performance art and painting and all kinds of different things. It's a lot of fun. Yeah. <laughs> so before we wrap this up, why don't you um, tell us how to contact you or your website to look at? Our website is studiochannelislands.org. Um, we prefer people contact us through the website because we have such a small staff, but our phone number is 805-383-1368. Great. Well, thank you for coming. Thank you for having us. Um, so is there anything else that we didn't get to that you would like to touch on? Oh, well, we have a new executive director, Peter Tyus. So if anybody wants to come by and meet him, he has some great programs that he's introducing. Um, we are located in Old Town Camarillo. A lot of people get us confused with the university. So we are at 2222 Ventura Boulevard in Old Town. And again, anybody can find us on our website at studiochannelislands.org. Great. Well, thank you for being on City Scene. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks thank for you. having us.